body. Let me open this. Let me uh, make a new page that is services first and then I will add it to it. So I will create a page of services. Then uh, in the head tag I will put so head and here I will put title tag. So this is the body is there. Start with body. And then here I will put the content. Okay. Yeah, is it clear now? Yeah, voice is clear now. Is it okay now? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. So let me save it into my own folder. That was uh, on the desktop. It was HTML codes. So this was HTML codes. So I have made the page name services .html. Okay. Okay. So in this now I will go to some company services pages. So I told you software and website and we will follow that on same website which is visited the last time.
So in the tools, I will go to the size option here, and I want the large one. So I'll select large. Okay. So you can customize your your search in Google. Okay. So let's take something which is a little bit better type of thing. So I want to take this one. Let's see what is the size. Okay. This size is better. So let me go to the link. Always uh, when you're downloading a banner or a big size image, always visit the website and download it. Don't save at that place because if you're saving from that place, you will uh, the image size will be very small. Okay? Or very the, the size will be reduced. So as a name as back. background I will put this so that it looks little better and uh, these text as bold so that it uh, is become readable so I will put it as bold I am doing both the things together and putting the paragraph also heading also so I customize this now I wanted to create a list of software okay <coughs> so today we will we'll learn how to use list. We are going to put a break here, one more break here. <coughs> then I will I will put here uh, we provide following services. Okay. This I will put in div tag. You can put it in, uh, in paragraph also. See, it depends on you. Okay. When you learn the different tags. Now you have to use your mind which you have wanted. Okay, so increase letters size is there for style. I'm putting in div tag because I wanted to customize the size of this text. Okay, that is why just that is the thing because of which I am putting the div tag. So I wanted the font size to be little bigger. Font size I wanted as uh, 30. So that was 35, let me make it 45. Okay, so this will be 30 because this will be the main heading, so it is bigger, and this will be a little smaller, and this will be in the medial, middle one paragraph, it is a normal style. Okay. <coughs> so it all depends on you. So let us save and see what it is. Okay, so it's okay. Further on, we will do the following services. Colon. And then in next line, I will put VR here. And then what I will just start creating a list so there are two type of list in HTML one is ordered list so first I will put ordered list ordered list uh, is written as OL OL stands for ordered list okay so it is also container tag it will open and it will close then I will put LI LI is for list items then again the LI one here again the LI here Again the li here, li will close here, again the li, uh, L, li here, and I will close here. What is li? li stands for list items, li stands for list items, uh, this one is wrong, 
So let me see what I have put here. Let me put here some thing. So we have written. So, so first service that we are providing is software. Software development. Then we are providing ERP. Enterprise. manages the whole company it's a very huge size of software okay so these are also developed by software companies then we develop mobile apps in bracket i can write down you know android have some numbering that is why it is known as ordered list and see this this has a numbering okay one two three four is the numbering okay and here you have an option of changing this thing okay so in ol if i write type command here type so what i can do i can change the order of this suppose i wanted into the roman format i don't want one two three so i will put capital i here See my listing will be increasing the size of the output. You can see the numbering has become from in the normal Roman format: one, two, three, four, five. If I will keep on increasing the uh, list, and the numbering will be automatically coming. Okay. So apart from this, what you can do? You can put a small i also. That will the uh, that will be a Roman number format in the smaller form. Apart from this, you can put capital A or small A B C D. So whatever has a format, like A B C D has a format. So, it will, so you whatever you like, you can do here. Okay? So this is the type command that that will work. Okay. Clear? Yes, sir. Putting a B R. I wanted another list. Okay. So. Okay, B S B R instead of the D L I, sir. Pardon? Uh, you can use but br will not work uh, for the listing okay like we are getting 1 2 3 4 for if you are going to put br then it will not create a list suppose if i if i put here br and if i write, write down something like machine learning suppose we are into machine learning also type of development and we are putting br here You can see this has no listing. This is not a part of a list. Are you ready? If we keep a number, that's it, sir. It looks like a list. Huh? If we start with the number, it looks like a list. List only, sir. See, uh, if we if we start with a number, means you wanted to put it uh, here as one, two, three, four. Here. Here. Before machine, you wanted to put here. Here you are saying. Yeah, yes, sir. So if you are going to put here, then what is the use of doing this OL tag? Why we are learning this? So this will become a manual thing. Okay, what you are doing, you are saying, is a manual thing. 
this is a manual means uh, you are doing it manually by with your own hands are you getting yes okay why we don't use manual things why we are not using this which you are telling so because see humans have a tendency of making errors if you are making this type of list suppose some at some place after one or after four you put by accidentally you put seven or eight who will check so you have to check it manually uh, or the or the tester the person who is responsible for testing the application have to check it manually that is why we have all these tags eh? are you getting because tag effects are permanent if you are if there is no tag and if you are trying to do it by yourself why html have so many tags because tag is something which is like a code in any language language have syntax why to make the things uh, in a proper way there there has to be some rule so tags define a rule are you getting so if there is no rule then there is no order there is nothing like a uh, see if i will say i will put div tag here so if there is no rule then you will say that why i will put div div tag i will put div tag in head are you getting so there these are rules you need to follow we cannot put br or this thing br is using used for breaking the line okay so if you put br tag anywhere forcibly you can break the line but actually it is not following the rules okay you are by force you are breaking the list items okay suppose i, I wanted to put a space between mobile and apps in the same list line so i will put br so this this br tag will force apps to be written on the next line see this will force because the br the uh, role of br is just to break the line wherever you are putting it it will break the line from there that is that's it okay similarly the role of the ordered list is to create the list okay it will be in some order maybe 1 2 3 4 maybe in the roman format 1 2 3 4 or roman number small size 1 2 3 4 4 or a b c d capital a b c d or small a b c d you put small a so, okay got it so there has to be some order this has some order a b c d order okay so the next list is an ordered list next one is an ordered list i going to put br here and the unordered list just like ordered list is ol so unordered list will be ul unordered list will be ul and li is for list item an ordered list can be like anything an ordered list and i am putting an hr here and after that i will list down the things this we have done this okay an ordered list i will uh, uh, i will write down something here like this we provide unordered list 
at a place where there is no requirement of putting an order okay here also type command will work but it has very limited type of type now circle is already there you can put a square here also and uh, if i put circle there will that will become a hollow type of thing you can see it is if i increase the size very higher size and even it will be in the shape of a box okay and there is one more option uh, let me see in some browsers it work if i put here circle some places it work but not all places ha ah, it works so you will see this hollow circle is there okay clear Are you getting? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So <coughs> this is known as <coughs> an ordered list. So is this clear? <coughs> is this clear? Yes, sir. Okay. So let's proceed. we have seen this so let's uh, move to other tags so now we'll uh, see uh, we are doing the hyperlink tag uh, we'll see a little different way of using a hyperlink tag okay. so let's again go to the hyperlink so i told you hyperlink is used to connect two pages and it can be two type one is internal link when you are connecting your own website pages that like we have done or you can connect website links or link of external file to your uh, website okay so just now i am creating my internal link only so uh, i will create an internal link of a page okay or i can create a link of something else also i can create a link of downloadable file suppose i am attaching a downloadable file as, as uh, this one back one okay so i am putting a downloadable file as let me see we have it in what folder or not let me increase the size little so i am putting one more image here or i will i will put it from here only okay so what i will do i will go to the properties i will take the location from here i will put the location here space here and the name is tag dot jpg okay <coughs> i wanted to i wanted this image to be downloaded when i click one image on my screen okay suppose i wanted to put one image here on the services when i click on it it should be downloaded okay so i will first search for an image on services so software services means from one image i am going to download another image or another file behind that image okay or i can put a file also behind that okay it is not necessary i put an image so suppose this image or any any of the images so i take this image only also so take any of them that then makes a matter so i am downloading this image this image as I will save it again into the same course. So I put new here. Whatever name you want, you can put here. So for that, what I need to do, I need to put image tag here. Okay. So let's see. And you will see that what actually it is happening. You may not recognize it now. So the name was. What name we have given? That is name was new. 
it is new dot jpg and i will adjust the height and also i will keep it a little uh, short height a bit so the image is of very it looks little size of okay so let me show you ha huh? ha ah. image the tag is an empty tag so you can see this there this is an image on the website okay let me increase the size more because it is getting very not able to visualize how you get to know that this is a link see your arrow will cursor will change into this finger type of thing okay so if you click on this that image will get downloaded if so i click on this see this this is there this is there for download okay and if i i can attach other things also suppose i copy this services part i copy this much okay and i put it into a word file Show you how companies do. Okay. So let me open this file. I will put it here. I am going to save it. File, save. So I will save it on desktop. Is it not not visible to anyone? It is not visible. Huh? It is not visible, sir. Some are saying they are visible. Some are saying not visible. Okay, let me share it again. See this now? Is it visible? Sir. Yes, sir. <coughs> so this is the services page. Okay, again, and here I have attached the link. If I click on this, in the what happens in Chrome? If you click, it gets downloaded. Okay, because PDF reader uh, is now inbuilt in every browser. So if you get this page, and now you get the download link from here. You click here, then it will be downloaded. 
you will ask you to save where you want to save okay. want to save in the downloads folder okay. so this happens in browser if you have any video file you must have seen that it, it gets down it gets opened in that okay. if, you, if you press the back button we are back into our own website so this way you can attach a image to an image a image to a page so i have attached this image to this thing and now i will show you how to attach the page okay similarly here only put a br tag again br tag again and i will do the same thing here okay. this time i will attach a page here so we'll go back to the home page that was the index page .html which we have made it already okay and this image i will put it some other image here so let me go to the browser view uh, let me put some other background with this background save this this is again the desktop this is again the external course So no, I wanted to put a small size only. So size will matter, uh, uh, obviously matter. But I am just showing you how to use it. That will depend on the company. The image sizes and the banners. There will be a proper designer in your company who will be actually designing and giving it to you. Being a coder, you don't need to design the images because we are learning here. So you should know how to increase or decrease the size of an image. Although when you are working in a company. they will provide you the designer will provide you with the exact size which you will want okay but i will show you i will make you learn how to resize the images with the whole help of code how to use the free tools online to do this okay but because you are just like a, there is a stepney in a car so these things when you are designing like image or we are designing the banner so you are a stepney for the company means in in the case of emergency they will only ask you to do the designing of part one okay because not we are not talking about the code i'm talking about the core designing means the background that i have used i have downloaded it and used it but in company they will not allow you to download it because they may be uh, that may be a copyright one okay so that is not your headache that some designer will give or company will take it from other vendor and give it to you okay you have to use it in the form of code that you have to insert into your page okay So here I will put the name as sub sub dot jpg. Okay, so let's get back to this place only. Okay. Go to services page. Refresh it. We have one more image here. So this is connected to a website, my own website. If I click over here, see, I am back on my home page. Okay. This was my company homepage. I click on service. I will go to the services page. No, we are not going to because this is service and actually the name of services. So let me change this one also. We scored also. Okay. I will open up more pet clusters here. So I have given the link for service. Okay, his name is services. Are you getting what the problem was? So you need to identify these things. Okay. Now I click on it. Now you will. Okay, 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 okay. Again, the page's name is service. Index. If I click on this, goes to services. Now it is. Here it was not refreshed. Now it is refreshed. Okay. If I click here, I am back to the home page. So I have connected a link. Okay. From there, I have connected the with the help of image, and here I have connected with the help of link. So I have shown you how to connect with the help of link also with the image also. You can make anything as a link, and it will be okay. There. Are you getting? So one thing you have must have seen on uh, many websites that I will show you here. When I am writing the text here, I have written this much only about the company. Sir. So I will put one more link here. Just after this bold tag, a h r f equals to b more. And 
this here I will go to the website which I have opened and I will put their link here suppose I wanted a person to go at that place and read more about suppose suppose I don't want to write here more so I want a person to go there and read it I will, I will make this as a link see your website will become a link for the other website see you must have seen this thing in, in many websites when you open it it is written read more you click on read more so you even you see either you see your full page of your company or you see this are you getting so you can go at that particular place and read from there only So these are the things. Is it clear? This is the index page, first page, we will link. This was our service page. Okay. This course I will share with you all. Okay. Done till here. So I will share. Uh, I think I have shared or I will share this estimate tax list. So there is a list of lot of tax, and we'll be seeing them also. Most of them. Okay. So I have not shown you the comment one. Let me show you the comment one. How to use the comment. So comment. What is a comment tag? Comment tag is basically made used to make an indentation. Means if, suppose I wanted to. Users or a developer to know what this page is for. I will write down here. This page is for the developer, and it will tell you about some any services. So if you put this this tag, what this tag does, actually it is not visible to the user. This tag, whatever you write here, it is not visible to. User. On the screen, this tag has no effect. On the screen, I am I am repeating my words. On the front screen, okay, it has no effect. This is a type of comment. So comments are for the developer or the person who is seeing the code. Okay, it will not show you anything on the screen. The refresh it. Don't see any changes. Here. Okay, but if you go to the background course section, you can see it is written there only. But it is not visible. If you see the color, if I zoom in, if I zoom in, you see the color is green. So if the color is green, that means the user is not directly able to vis visualize this on the front page this is a comment okay so comments are not made for the person or the user it is just for the developer or the designer to know about that particular thing okay just like just like when you buy any product you get a user manual the so user manual is for you okay user manual is not written on the device user manual they give you on paper or software or cd you read it how your device works so that is why if you are designing a software somewhere you have to write down between the codes that why which thing you have used for why suppose i am using 10 times h1 tag so why you are using 10 times h1 tag in particular page so in order to justify you can put one comment tag and you can write down one line so that the developer who is working just after you or suppose you leave the company and some other developer comes and is working on the same project he or she should know at least what you are doing why you are making this code why you are taking this tag why you are uh, putting two images together okay and what what the actual meaning of that so for that you use comments comment is an empty tag it ha doesn't have any other closing it closes by itself so you have to put this opening tag 
exclamation mark and then you can write down anything anything and then you can close this okay. are you ready so if you go to our tag list hyperlink we have done bold we have done big we have done body we have done br we have done center alignment we have done okay there is a tag dl dd dd okay just like you wanted to define something suppose you are writing a definition of something or wanted to define something then you can use dl dt dd okay so if i use this tag i just copy it from here so that to save time you put it here already so i wanted to put in this so just after the list shall put br here so dl is data yeah hmm i uh, wanted to put in a space that is added so that i wanted it to make it more space so that it is visible okay defining term suppose i wanted to define machine suppose i wanted to define java okay or i wanted to define definition of the term definition is this is a language developed by microsoft description can be it is a cross platform